Hi, I'm Alvin Sequeira, Vice President for Security and Networking at VMware. What I'd like to do today is share a little bit of VMware strategy, especially as it pertains to networking and security and the ramifications to the ecosystem and uh, architectures in the data center. First of all, VMware, well known for server virtualization, we are in a phase now in enterprises as almost every single major enterprise, in fact, uh, more than 250,000 customers have gone through various stages of server virtualization. In fact, this year saw an inflection point where more than half of application workloads now run on virtualized servers. Beyond server virtualization, there are tremendous uh, other uh, advances being made in data centers, whether they are in enterprises or clouds. First of all, server virtualization, along with desktop virtualization, is now being evolved to private clouds. The second big trend we are seeing, and where we are focusing a lot of our energy at VMware on, is the evolution from private clouds to hybrid clouds. Hybrid clouds for us effectively means taking your corporate um, architectures, your corporate data centers, and having these corporate balloons, if you will, uh, manifest themselves on one of our partner clouds and having secure access to that private bubble within a, um, um, a hybrid cloud hosted by one of our data center partners. From the perspective of the upper layers, what they're effectively looking for, especially from a networking perspective, are isolated connectivity uh, where they get complete connectivity between their workloads uh, regardless of uh, whether these are within a rack, across racks, across sites. So you can see from a, uh, from a very fundamental perspective, the data center is evolving in a very significant fashion. Uh, virtualization of servers and desktops, these new apps are calling for a lot more dynamic, fungible networking architecture, one that can be programmed and allocated on demand on a pertinent uh, basis. I've talked uh, a lot about the need for transformation and change in the data center. Um, obviously, VMware knows and fundamentally understands that this is not a one company exercise. It takes an army, it takes a village to come together and build an ecosystem. Uh, one of the things I'm really excited about to, with uh, the relationship with Arista is the innovation that I see there. Uh, they have taken some of the programmability and uh, the key events uh, and APIs in the vCenter platform, the vCloud platform, and have been able to leverage it to, in fact, use the strengths of their programmable operating system to, in fact, uh, tie together seamlessly uh, some of the physical constructs, the virtual constructs, and the cloud constructs, so that if you are a network admin that came in from the physical world, you can look at it from that perspective. On the other hand, if you are a virtual infrastructure admin or a cloud provider, you could look at it from a logical virtual construct. These are the kind of innovations and frameworks that are so essential for us to take uh, uh, virtual and cloud networking and data center architectures to a next level. So I'm really appreciative of Arista's work in this space.